I'm sure most of you found yourself in a situation where you're lounging on the couch, your feet on the coffee table, you have a coffee or a drink in your hand, watching your favorite program, but then having to disturb your comfy state to put down your empty cup. So what do you do? Well, our DIY expert, Andrew, has got just the thing. Dude, nice to have you with us Good again. Good to see you too. So, um, you know, this little scenario that I've sketched, you know, I think most people understand what I'm saying. I'm sure you definitely, do Definitely, definitely. And we've got a solution. I'm so happy to hear that. Okay, really simple. Doing? It's an armrest table that goes over the armrest of your couch. And I've got Builders Warehouse to cut all our timber for us, cut to size, so all we have to do is just assemble it. Great, what, what are we using? We're going to use a cordless drill. We're going to use a set square. We've got some screws. We've got uh, some drill bits and a countersink bit. We've got tape measure. We've got a scraper, pencil, some wood glue, and some wood filler. And we've also got some spray paint. So should we get cracking? Let's get cracking. Okay, Let's right. Start. These are our legs, so let's pull those over to the side. We don't need those yet. This is our top piece. We're gonna mark out some holes along the edge. We're gonna then screw it down into the top of our legs. Okay, so let's mark that out first of all. I'm using 16 millimeter thick timber, okay? So basically, I'm gonna mark out along the edge there, and I'm gonna go in eight millimeters in. Note that the dimensions may differ to suit the width of your armrest, so take the correct measurements before you start. Right, then we're going to drill some pilot holes all the way through that. Um, we're going to position it on top of the legs, drill the pilot holes all the way through to the legs as well, and um, countersink the top, and away we go. Countersinking screws is an easy and quick way to make a wood building or craft project look professional. Be very careful not to make the holes too deep. Right, now let's mark this up. Put that guy there, we've got one leg this side, another leg that side. All right. Get to roughly around the round position. Okay, then we're just going to hold this into place. You line up that side, draw a clearance hole. Okay, so you've put them all in. I'm just going to push them through. In comes the legs. Okay, lift up the legs. But before that, we're actually going to seal the surface with glue. All right. So use the wood glue and seal it. To reinforce it even Exactly. And let's get a nice bond there between the timber, keep it rigid and stuff. Great. Okay. Slide it back and forth gently and you fill it lock into position. Do this side. With the screws in place, Fill the top of the screw holes with wood filler and when dry, sand the frame smooth to remove any sharp edges. Finally, apply two to three coats of your favorite color. Andrew's using a black primer as well as a black semi-gloss spray paint. And there you have it, there's our final product. Got our final coat on there, there it is. Let's see the steps again. Have your super wood cut as per the diagram on our website. Countersink screw holes. Then drill the pilot holes. Apply wood glue to the top edge of the legs and screw on the top. Fill the screw holes with the wood filler and spray paint in the color of your choice. Okay, Seven, I really think this will add a touch of class to your house. Log into expressoshow.com for all the details. Fantastic is that. Now I don't have to use my iPad as the armrest anymore. <laughs> Shh, don't tell the boss. I'm only kidding. Because uh, you, you're not going to get a new one then. You've been abusing it. <laughs> but if that's inspired you and you'd like to take on a DIY project of your own, then you can win a 250 Rands Builders voucher. And in order to stand a chance to do that, uh, all you need to do is SMS the keyword Builders, including your name and city, to 33728. Absolutely. And you can go and, you know, splash out. Just buy everything that you need to uh, do that DIY on your own home. Because everybody can now. It's exactly. as easy as that. It's as easy as that. Man, I hope you've enjoyed that you've been enjoying this show as much as we have. So much inspiration from Africa Pella, the youngsters we were talking now to talking to right now from the Rotary Club. You know, that's what I love about this show, this feel good breakfast show. That's what I love about this country. So many talented individuals right here. I mean, I'm sitting next to one as well. Oh, huh? Look at you, look at you, Aww, look at you. Oh, high five. Okay, okay, okay. That's too much, too much. We're gonna take a quick ad break. We'll be right back.